Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again, or for the very first time, to the Farts and Crap Show, where today, as per usual, it's your host, Anjo, here with part 37 of Fire Emblem the Blazing Blade, or whatever, 2003 on the Wii U. Yeah. I'm pissed. Like, I'm frustrated, for sure, but like, this is the fourth time be attempting this mission because somebody keeps like I keep losing one of like my key people and it's not cool like in this mission in the first three attempts Marcus has died Rebecca has died uh, I think Priscilla died once and Fiora died and I, I'm not cool with any of those like Fiora kind of like, stings less because she's new. But she's a Pegasus Knight. Like, Pegasus Knights are incredibly awesome. So, so yeah, I'm already familiar with this mission. Um, that's who I'm bringing. And uh, let's go ahead and get started. Doesn't really matter. And you know what? I'm very tired. I've been doing voice acting all day, so I'm just going to give you guys the cliff notes. Uh, Ninian's not doing well, Nils is going to give her some of his power so she can actually help Lord Elwood because, I don't know, she's got like a crush on him now or some shit. And there's like this cool, like, unique art that they show while he's like, I'm gonna transfer some of my shit to you. And, um, yeah, so she's a dancer. She can basically do what Nils did before where he can go up to a unit and, uh, play for them. And then they can have a second turn. Or she has this awesome protection spell that only works for one turn, but it is really helpful. Um, and that's pretty much it. So she's a really good support unit, but she is squishy as hell, so you gotta keep her very safe. And that's kind of where I keep screwing up in this mission because. Like, I am kind of tired at this point, like I'm not really strategizing like I should be. And uh, you know, even the squishy characters, I don't know, I, I kind of assumed a little bit too much that they could, you know, take a shot without dying. Not really something they can do, but you know, I, I assumed. And I also went the other way with it, and my really strong characters, I assumed, you know, could take a couple shots without dying, which that's how I lost Marcus at one point. Which is not cool, because Marcus is my strongest character, bar none. Like, eh, the gap is lessened now, but he's still my strongest guy. So this armory sucks, they only sell iron shit. I'm just gonna sell the blue gem, get some cash, leave, that's it. Uh, there's also a vendor down here which sells some magic stuff, which is good. Uh, there's also a vendor up here which sells vulneraries and door keys. And this armory has the good shit. So, uh, I'm gonna have... Fior, yeah, I guess. Why is she here? I didn't move her. Whoops. Well, that's not what I intended to do. I'm going to have her go here because she's going to be blocking for somebody actually here. And make sure she has the javelin equipped. Have her wait. Because, yep, there's a thing. And I'm going to have Legault go down here because I'm going to have him do some shopping in the next turn. Have him wait, and then have Loen go over here and attack with the Steel Axe on this one, because weapon proficiency. I'm trying to get his Axe proficiency up. And then I'm going to have Rebecca go visit this house real quick, because they have a gift. This lady's annoyed because she can't get sleep. So she's like, hey, here, take this. It's a restore staff. It cures sleep and poison. 
And I'll have Priscilla go over here and trade, because she can actually use it. And then also merch and give the heal and take amend. Because mend is better. Uh, I'm gonna have Marcus go right here temporarily. The axe and wait because there's an enemy up here that's going to try to come down here and surprise us. And I'm going to have Dorcas go to the place up here. Make sure his steel axe is equipped. Have him wait. And then have... Minion, go here and dance for Raven so he can have another turn real quick because I'm trying to get him more experience. And I'm going to go ahead and be using save states on this one just because like I'm tired. Like I'm physically tired and I'm tired of doing this mission. Yep. Mm -hmm. And so far I can't think of anything I possibly screwed up on. Oh, he's getting that crit. Nice. And sending Raven up like that. Oh. That could have been really bad for him, but he made a terrible decision by attacking Dorcas. He might have been able to kill uh, Raven. On the real. Come on, Fiora, get the second. Nice! There we go. Get that experience, girl. Your little sister is making you look weak. go here and absolutely end this unit, whatever, I forget what they're called. Alright, I'm gonna Rebecca here and wait. Have Priscilla and here and no, actually, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to have Urk go forward here. Have him wait. Because there are a bunch of more units around here. And Dorcas as well. Go here. Item wait. And there's units up here as well. So I'm going to have Fiora fly up here. Make sure she has... Yep, and wait. There's an enemy right there. Ninian. Ah, gonna Priscilla go up here and heal. Raven? Yep. He doesn't need a mend. I probably should have kept a, a heal on her as well. That would have been a good idea. I could have Marcus pick one up for her, actually, at the tent over here. Or Loen, either one. Probably Marcus, though. Um, item... Yep, I can wait. Then Legault up here. And wait. I'm going to have Raven to hang back for the most part for a second. I 
and same with Elwood because I can't lose him. And I'll have Ninian dance for low in here so he can catch up with the other guys. And because he's one of the most defensive characters I have. guys. He's going for Urk, which is a terrible idea. Urk will absolutely end him. Mm-hmm. Like, again, that's a terrible idea. Pegasus Knights, the Wyvern Riders are also very, very susceptible to bows. So I'm going to have Rebecca... Yeah, I'm going to give Rebecca first shot. Just because I'm really trying to get her more um, experience. Of course, Ninny and I'm trying to level her up as well, so she's less squishy. Um, I'll have Raven go up here and make sure he's got Iron Blade up. There we go, because there's another guy up there with the Poison Axe. And Urk. Uh, yeah, I could have Urk take him out, actually. Attack of Thunder on this dude. Should not be a problem. Indirect attacks are probably the best way to go for these guys with poison weapons. Of course, I got another archer up here, which... Why did that disappear? Oh, because he had the thing. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'm going to have Loen go up here and just wait. There we go, so I can see him again. Rebecca over here, I attack with the steel bow on this guy, might take him out, yeah there we go, Rebecca that experience and level up, she's at 9, okay, she needs one more, strength and speed, okay, both good, she's lacking in both, and Dorcas could actually get right up on that ass, attack with steel axe on this fucker, Get within his range so he can't counterattack. Of course, like the first time Dorcas doesn't finish his meal. We got Fiora go up here and wait. I would wait a little bit. Priscilla. Uh doesn't actually really need to heal anybody right now. That's good. I need Marcus to catch up. Great. Good job getting poisoned, Dorcas. And they're just like ganging up on him. Why'd you walk right next to <laughs> like why <laughs> I thought that was an indirect attack. I was like you do know you're within range. <laughs> like this is Dorcas we're talking about. You don't want to get within range of him. There you go, that's how you do a smart attack. 
And I'm gonna let Raven take revenge here in a sec. There you go, Dorcas. You gotta finish what you started there, bud. The antitoxin, which you'll definitely have use for here in a minute. Um. Take care of this guy. Yeah, I could let one of my sword wielders take him out, but I mean, either or really. Oh, Nadian's way back here. All right, that's fine. Whatever. Blade on the moon here. I'll get that crit. Ugh. Not bad. Speed, strength, HP. Not like, you know, perfect level up, but pretty decent. Uh, Priscilla still doesn't have a I can actually just have her go to the thing. Yeah, because they sell them. No, they don't. They do not sell them right there. What am I thinking of? Wait, did I have Legal not go to the shop? Did I forget to have him do that? forgot about that, didn't I? I didn't have Fjord. No, I didn't have her do it either. Shit. Alright. I'll just have her do it. She, she's got the momentum and stuff. Alright. I'll have him go there, and then Elwood, whatever. Marcus, go up here. Wait. We still have all of our cash. Whoops, I totally forgot to have them. Oh, that's it. Fuck. Yeah, I was gonna say, I doubt they'll do shit, honestly. Um... Yeah, I'm not gonna send Priscilla in harm's way, but I am gonna have her use Torch over here. So we can see the enemies hiding over there, because they definitely are. And probably have Urk visit the place here. You need to exchange special items. He's the one who's gonna give us the one for, yeah, Pegasus Knights. Mm-hmm. Just fucking awesome. Uh, send Shine to Merlinus. I don't care who. And gonna have Rebecca do the armor shopping. Have her buy. Whoops. Steel bow, yep. Uh, no, just the one. Probably like two steel axes. Yep. Steel lance, yep. 
and two steel swords. And... yeah. It's gonna do it. Of course I'm gonna have... I'm gonna go back here. Can't believe that completely spaced that. Buy a heal, yes. And thunder. Right? Yeah, thunder. Yeah. Maybe sell nothing? Alright, cool. Okay. So this part is a little bit tricky because basically have this gate right here of three tiles and these enemies are going to try to draw you out but you want your tankiest guys basically protecting those tiles um, that's pretty much it so Dorcas is poisoned obviously We don't have either of our healers right now, so I'm just going to use one of the antitoxins. And I'm just going to have Loen right here, probably using a sword. Because that's universally like the best thing for all of these units that are lying in wait. Marcus, I'm going to do the same thing, except put him right here and have an item use the sword as well and wait and then Raven I'm gonna have him probably just go here and have him use a vulnerary then Legault no that's a bad idea Wait, and then Ellawood. Here, and wait. And then Ninian, back here, and have her wait. There we go. Our units are spread a little bit too thin at the moment. So I'm going to kind of just buy some time while I take out some enemies that are foolish enough to attack Lowen or Marcus or Dorcas. Any of them, really. Probably should have re-equipped him with the bow since he's, uh, you know, in the back row, but whatever. Doesn't really matter at the moment. Yep. At least they're smart enough to use indirect attacks. Actually gonna have Ninian go here and in case this is a terrible idea I'm gonna create a restore point because it's a little bit riskier but I'm gonna have her dance use Ninny's grace for Raven HP, speed, luck, defense, and resistance. That's really good for her. Have Raven go up here and attack with his iron blade on this one. And finished him off. Good. Dorcas, I'm probably just gonna have him equip the iron bow right here and use a vulnerary. Oh, Priscilla's up here. What am I talking about? Never mind, I thought I sent my other guys. Oh, because she doesn't have a. a what you call it? It's a 
hair? What is that? Yeah, I think that was... It's had a hair in my mouth. Um... Okay, so I'll probably have her heal the gold, I guess. Just wait till Rebecca gets back up here. And Fiora. see better. And I guess I could have Marcus or Lowen take out one of these guys. Either one doesn't matter. Or just kind of wait and see what they do. Friggin' coward. This is the part where I would probably not... Wait, does she still get the experience the same way if I do this? I don't know. Um, gonna attack, steel bow... There? Hopefully this will take out son of a bitch. Alright, Rebecca, you had your shot. Erk is going to take over on that one for now. Attack with thunder on this fucker. Okay. Then I'm going to pull Raven back a little bit. It's going to need healing. Well, yeah, just going to use Dorcas. Since, you know, he can one-shot those guys. And I would send some people up there. But I'm pretty sure they'll come to me. Oh, she can't get there anyway. Alright. Well, I could if I just had Ninian dance for her, actually. So... Trade... Priscilla, give her a heal for some vulneraries, and... Pretty much it. We'll move Marcus up one and have him wait. And Lowen up one as well and have him wait. And then end there. Which might be enough to provoke. Holy shit, what the hell!
Okay, well this is bad. Um... Okay, so there's one thing specifically I need Legault to do. And I think it can still work from here, so I'm just gonna create a restore point, yep. Just in case uh, I make it an error, which is very possible, and this part is quite important. Um, so I need Legault to go here and steal from Oleg, the hero's crest. And then I'm gonna need Marcus to go here and rescue Legault. Probably just move back a space and wait. Make sure he's got the steel sword equipped, which he does. And this black fang dude, I'm just gonna have Priscilla stat. Wait, no, not yet. We have Dorcas go forward and attack steel axe on this guy. There we go. does not have a range attack apparently. I'm gonna have Raven go here and attack with his iron blade on this archer. Just took him out, okay, good. A lot of these moves are risky. Like they're not the safest moves I could be making for sure, but I'm also trying to still get people experience like Raven, who also oh weapon level. Nice. Um, and actually, just to cover him a little bit better, I'm gonna low end move right here. An item. Yeah, steel swords equipped. Have him wait. And. I could have Urk do this, but I'm gonna give Rebecca some experience and attack with the steel bow on this fucker. And of course, she didn't finish him off again. Okay. Um, and then I'll have Urk. Oh wait, I could have Ninian just give her a second turn. Right. There we go. That's a lot of experience for Rebecca. Okay, Priscilla, Ellawood, and Fiora are all fine. This guy is using a steel sword. So I could have her do a long range attack, but then Freaking Oleg has a bow, so he could he could kill Fiora, like pretty pretty much guaranteed. Um, Urk, however, could probably take it or avoid it. So I'm gonna have him use Thunder on this guy. It's like one less guy to worry about. And Urk has been proving to be most formidable recently, so. And actually, you know what, I could probably have Fiora take Legault, and then move back here and wait. There we go. I was trying to remember how to do that. Uh, then I guess have oh, 
swapping it. I could have her try to heal Dorcas, but Dorcas would... He could choose to go over and then just shoot Priscilla. So with their current formation, that's kind of a risk, but honestly I'd rather lose Priscilla than some of my other characters. In all honesty. Whereas now he doesn't really have a cheap shot on anybody, but I did just create a save state, so... I think he'll be enough. Is that like half? Right? Yeah, there we go. I mean, hopefully Priscilla will be fine. I guess we're about to find out. Motherfucker. I, I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. I was like, she's a little bit too squishy. Oh, fuck. I should have just made the save state right there. Alright, so this is where I had Legault go up, steal from Oleg, Hero Crest. There we go. Then had Marcus up, rescue, then pull him back. Further, wait. Then I had. Fiora, take, back, and then, I could honestly just like keep her back there, uh, and have Rebecca go up here, attack, steel bow on this guy, she doesn't do the second attack, so I'm going to have to use Ninian to finish him off. Have Raven go up here, attack with Iron Blade on this Archer dude. Finishes him off, great. That'll give him a level up, fantastic. I think that's the same stats too. Level increase, great. Super good. Then have Dorcas probably go here, attack, steel axe on this guy. Yep. Actually, I'm going to go a little ballsier and steel sword on this guy right here. Okay, he's got a high avoidance stat right now because he's on the forest tile, I think is what it's called. HP, speed, defense, nice. Priscilla not heal Dorcas, because that would be foolish. But have Ninian go up here and dance for Rebecca. Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm going to have her pull back and attack the Steel Bow from there. There's no sense in keeping her close to the front line where she's not going to be doing much of anything. Actually, same with Ellawood as well. I'm going to have him pull back just a tiny bit, and then Priscilla probably. Let's see, Urk can fill this gap right here. He's not going to be, like, you know, beefiest, but. He's strong enough. Mm -hmm. 
Alright, Eric, time for your test, bud. Nice. It's like, you think you can just walk up to me? <laughs> like, granted, he has killed a good number of my guys. But, I never let him go up to Urk before. Dude, Raven, nice, dude. Getting it fucking done. Alright, there's only a couple more... Oh wait, did I already take him out? Oh, I guess so. Alright, Fiora, I'm gonna have her go way back here and drop... Yeah, and then just kinda chill. Um... I'm gonna let her get her licks in. She might get a crit, so I doubt it, but you know. Why not? Get some experience, you know? Alright. Just in case I fuck this up, because that is very possible, I'm gonna create a restore point right now, even though I basically got this in the bag. And, you know... This is probably a bad idea, but I... Out of all these guys... To, like who gets the experience let's see he's got the silver axe equipped so he can't counterattack right now I think so I'm gonna have him just attack iron bow yeah there we go and uh yeah Marcus and Lowen have both got KOs up the ass but you know who hasn't yeah, I got that weird down input. Just random down inputs every so often. Uh, Raven. He's probably gonna get killed. But... Steel Sword has a high crit. And as long as he deals damage, I think he'll finish him off. So... yeah. Uh, let's try this very stupid idea that might work. Or I could let Urk take it, but honestly, Raven's the next one I'm probably going to promote, so... There you go. In defeat, there is only death. Ugh. This motherfucker. Strength and HP, you know, that's fine. Totally fine. Dope. Got through that thing without anybody dying. Yes. We are okay. Excellent. Um, and yeah, like I said, guys, because this isn't my first time playing this mission, like this is actually the fourth or fifth time, uh, I do know for a fact there's actually a lot of, what do they call it, epilogue? Like, after a story, there's, like, the story that's the wrap-up, like, le or leading up to something else. Is it epilogue? It sounds right. Epilogue definition. A section, a speech at the end of a book or play that serves as a comment on the conclusion of what has happened. Yep. Yeah. The final concluding act or event, yeah. So basically the epilogue of chapter 20. It's uh, it's very long, there's lots of story, and I don't have time for that right now because we're already like 10 minutes over the target time, so... But yeah, finally got it done with no deaths. And I didn't even have to use any of my staves. Stave. Save states except for the one that I knew was a bad idea. So... Yeah, protect your squishies. Your squishies will die very quickly if they are not protected either by space or by stronger people so protect them but anyway thank you all for being here guys greatly appreciate it and a very special thank you going out to the current farts and corruption members which at the time of recording is just novellus draconis but if you want to be incredibly awesome and support the show a bit more directly and get in all the on all those membership benefits like novellus draconis check out the join button down below tier start at three bucks a month Yes, that's only 10 cents a day. 
and you guys also get to pick out series such as these via that uh, community tab, the members only posts here on YouTube. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this one. I'm going to get some food and get some sleep because it is late. And yeah, take care and have a beautiful day. Till the next one. Ta-ta for now. <laughs>